So as we talked about in our interview, I'm Nancy, this is Carolyn, um, a big tradition in our friendship has been the making of zebra cake for our birthdays. Mm -hmm. How many zebra cakes? 40, 82. Right, 40 41 years. years. So we thought it'd be fun to show you about how to make zebra cake. So this is the box. This is called Famous Chocolate Wafers. They look like that. And this is a very easy cake to make, but you have to refrigerate it overnight. You have to make it. Yeah. So what do we start with, Carolyn? A whipping cream. Yep. And, and we'll chocolate wafers. That's it. And what do you put in the whipping cream just in case it don't Well, we put um, powdered sugar and vanilla. Right. Not too sweet. I like it less sweet than you. Yes, true. Okay. I like a quarter of a cup. You like more like half a cup? Yeah, probably. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so you put the whipping cream in between each of the wafers. This is important because what if you put too not much? Not enough. No. Some years I put too much. Right. What I think I think sometimes I put too many. Well, too much. Nothing it, happens. No, too much it just doesn't taste as good, but too little, there's a problem. What's the problem? Oh here, let's look like a zebra. This so they can see. What do you think the problem no, is? No, too little. The, <laughs> too little and the, um, the wafers. You're using your hands do, in the way. Well, you have to use your hands. That's what I part. said. <laughs> <laughs> too little and the wafers do not um, soften. Because what happens is, so you make a little log, right, with this. And what happens is that the overnight in the refrigerator. Yeah, now the package tells you eight. Oh. But that's not true. Carol and I have discovered over the 41 years you need to leave it in overnight at least 12 hours. Unless you forget. Sometimes it's only 8, but most of the time it's 12. Yeah. So anyway, what happens if you don't put enough, um, I don't know if you can see that, but if you don't put enough... I'm not forget. I wouldn't forget. <laughs> I'm saying sometimes if, you're, if your day is running long, I've right. never forgotten that would be right. the surprise. Then, so... The tradition of zebra cake is then you surprise each other in the morning with zebra cake. Of course, the real surprise would be shocking, and that would be if you didn't, you show, didn't up show up for 40 years. Really <laughs> that would be the surprise. And the candles have to be lit. That's a bad surprise. Which we didn't do that now, but you have to light the candles as you walk in the door. I think All we're right. running out of time. Now. Okay, so here we go. So you continue on to the end. Yes. You make one long log, and you cover it with whipping cream, refrigerate it overnight, and... It looks like this. Oh, except I do this. Yeah. Do you do this? No, I don't do that. No, but you do do that, and I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes I put sprinkles. Yes, I've seen sprinkles. Okay, on. where's the knife to cut? All right, this is the okay, important part. Just to make those sprinkles. Then you put candles. You have to cut it at a diagonal, like this, oh, and that is how you get the zebra stripes, mm -hmm. right? So let's just quickly put one on the plate. Oh, scoop it up with oh, There we go. We're running out of time. Isn't that pretty? Zebra cake. Hey, I'll do mine. Here's yours. Oh, oh I was going to share. Oh. <laughs> okay. You're right. We can share. Mm -hmm. Zebra cake. Zebra cake. Happy birthday. Cheers. Oh, wait. It's really good. Mm -hmm. It's excellent. Mm -hmm. <laughs>